On the takeaway menu today is an American hot Chicago pizza pie. Right, let's get cracking on the base. We've got yeast. Get it in the sachets. They're always seven grams into some water. Now, that's 600 millilitres of tepid water. That's going to wake up the dried yeast. For four pizzas, add one kilo of strong flour and a nice pinch of salt. Then in with 600 mils of yeasty water. This is going to do all the hard work for you. There is no right or wrong way to knead. You're just moving it about, uh, push it forward, push it back, stretch it, stretch it. Doing big batches is a great money-saving tip. You can always freeze what you don't need right now, and having a stash will help stop the urge to shell out on all those pricey takeaways. Leave the dough to prove, which means to rise, in a covered bowl for an hour. That is what yeast does. So what we do after an hour is we bash it back down. We now have a dough that's kind of developed in flavour. It's just phenomenal. I love it. The feel of it. Air in there. Gorgeous. So all I'm doing now is I'm just folding it under itself. I want to bring back the pizza pie, OK? Rub a little oil into the tins and scatter over some dry breadcrumbs for a little extra crunch on the base. This dough is just beautiful. I'm just going to pull it. You don't have to roll it. And I'm going to go into that tin like that. Leave the base to prove again for 15 to 20 minutes. Now for a really cheap, super quick tomato sauce. It's just one tin of tomatoes, two cloves of garlic, salt and a little dried oregano. Whiz it up. For a bit of heat, nick a little vinegar from some jarred pickled jalapenos. Friends, the sauce is done. The toppings are up to you, but I'm going to use two good quality sausages per pizza plus a few chopped jalapenos to make this American hot even hotter. So actually, I think cheddar is a wonderful melter. It really is. Little bombs of cheddar in and around that sausage. One finely sliced red onion, smashed up fennel seeds, and a good pinch of smoked paprika will really bring out the flavors. Absolutely gorgeous. Whack them into the oven for 20 minutes at 190. And when they're cooked, they'll look a bit like this. Oh, yes. Thick. Chunky. That's what I'm talking about. I admit, buying a takeaway pizza does have its perks, but they don't come cheap. This is six times cheaper than that. Girls, come and have a check of this. Grab away. Oh, thank Hi. you so much. Bring back the Chicago pizza pie. Crew, I think it's time for a little bit of pizza. Come on. Yay.